Hey guys, hope you're all doing well in this weird time. My name's Kira, I'm a high performance trampoline gymnast and today I'm going to talk you through how I do my hair for competitions. So today what I thought I would do, instead of doing the classic braids into a high ponytail, I thought what I would do is I would do, I've actually been doing this for the last um, couple of competitions where I part my hair down the middle, as you can see, it's not done very well, I have to redo it. Um, I do two braids on each side down into a low pony, just here. So what I'm going to start off with is I'm just going to do the parting. So I'll part down the middle and then I'll part um, down the side and then I'll part it into two sectors again. So we're going to go split these ones into two. When I split it, I like to angle it back a little bit so that when it goes back into a ponytail, there's no like bumps or creases. That's what I try to do anyways. There still does end up being some bumps and creases. But if I go, if I braid directly down, when I go back, see how there's like a bump there? The same thing happens when you braid. Okay, so now we're up to the braiding bit. Before I braid, so you can just see I parted it into two. Before I braid, I like to add a little bit of gel. I use, this is gel, but I usually use um, mousse, like foaming mousse, and I just like spray it onto my hands and then um, like zhuzh it into my hair. It just makes it hold a little bit better and it's not as like thick as gel is. Obviously, because we're in um, like lockdown pretty much, I didn't really think it was necessary to go to the shops and get mousse when I had gel here. So we're making do with what we've got. Alrighty, so today I'm gonna do, well usually, actually all the time, <laughs> I do um, outside braids. So the braid kind of like sits on top This is like the braids are quite so far. This one I'm going to talk you through how to actually like braid for you, for you braiding newbies out there. So. You grab your first little bit of hair, you split it into three just like a plait. Like that. Uh, you can either start at the front or the back, it actually it doesn't matter. Take a tiny little piece of hair and add it to your front section and then you're going to cross it under with the middle one you got to swap your hands around a little bit it's a bit confusing and then you're going to do the same thing for the back one so you grab a little piece of hair you add it to that bit and then you're going to swap it under the middle one so whichever piece of hair Whichever section you added hair to is the bit that goes under. And then if you're doing an inside braid, this is an outside braid, if you're doing an inside braid, you do it the opposite. 